topic, you can just bury us down. Even the ones you don't know about. Push it down, pull it down. How are you today? <laughs> Need us Castleberg here. Um, just because it seems to be my favorite tool these days, uh, especially in the light of being able and willing to receive from everyone and everything around you all the time. It's like, let's take our deepest barriers down, even the ones we don't know about. Push them down, pull them down, destroy and uncreate them. Wonderful. Uh, and would you be willing to just perceive? Perceive the energy around you, maybe from the sunshine, <laughs> maybe from the trees. If you're somewhere you can receive from anywhere, right? So inside, can you receive from the table? Can you receive from the chair? Can you receive from the plants? Maybe you have animals, right? <laughs> and if you're having trouble receiving from wherever you are, you can tap into what's behind me. <laughs> can you receive from the trees? Yes, everything that's around me right now. And would you be willing to take your deepest barriers down and receive more from me? So, I wanted to just invite you to, look at the view, <laughs> whatever it is. So, did you know that if you're not being ease, joy, and glory, you're not being you? <laughs> sure. There's always in life going to be some challenges and some difficulties and you can't have ease with it by just knowing that everything's working out in your favor, right? Have you ever noticed how when you're really joyful and happy, like nothing in the world is significant. <laughs> it's not, nothing is the end of the world, right? But the minute we go into a lack of joy, <laughs> then we start to close off our receiving. We start to close off what wants to contribute to us. Right? So if you're not being joyful, you're not being you, then what are those tools? What are those things that you can add that you can do that are, that get you back to that energy, right? So as many of you know, if I'm in the woods <laughs> and I'm hiking on a trail, I am so much more me. I am so much more joyful. <laughs> I'm having so much more fun. I even have more awareness. <laughs> I have more gratitude. So this is a trick that I use, and I love to come into the woods whether I'm <laughs> in a funk already or, or not. I don't need to be in a funk to be in the woods, right? But I know that this works for me. Like, inevitably, every single time I'm in some weird space, I get outside in nature, and it all melts away. I get my bars on, <laughs> access consciousness, the bars, 
If you've never had your barge on, I highly recommend going and getting your barge on. <laughs> um, I used to meditate a lot, and that was a contribution to me until I found the bars. <laughs> and then I was like, oh, the bars creates even more space for me. Right? So, but it doesn't matter. I'm not saying there's a right way or wrong way. I'm saying, what is it for you? What can you do or add to your life to bring more fun and joy right away? Thank you for being here. So very grateful for you. Have a magical day.